many times. It's not like we have a steady relationship just yet, but we've met a few times and it's been hot. Right? Yeah. Even though it's sporadic, I enjoy our meetings. Don't you? And still, he thought we were done. Well, statistics show that uh, not all of you have seen us before. So I wonder, how many of you have seen us before? One time counts, yes. How many of you have never seen us before? This is your first time? <laughs> oh. Well. How do you like it so far? You like it? It is pretty good, yes. I tell them that you're, you're okay. <laughs> but uh, since you are new here tonight, and some of these other folks, they are experienced. <laughs> They have seen this shit before. They know what's gonna happen. Yeah. But I'm talking to you now. You see, when we do our shows, we always end with the same song. Some of these folks might think it's a little bit predictable. Maybe even a little bit boring. I would like for you to think of it as I do, and they do, and some of you do. Consider it an orgasm. I mean, think about it. You know, we've we've spent uh, we've spent a, a Friday night together here. Been here with her. We've been dancing. I think we've been touched a little before. And I've been, I've been cracking jokes. And I've been wiggling my ass. And we've been throwing kisses and flirting and all that. I mean, you know that in a way. At least mentally, we are already fucking each other. Think about this, you know, after an hour and a half of fucking here downtown Montreal on a Friday night, don't you think that we deserve an orgasm? Before it starts hurting, you know, you need to save something for the second date as well. You don't always have to go to second base. You can keep it a little, but let's just say that we did. Now, Moms and dads, I know, I know, I am a foul-mouthed bastard. I say a lot of dirty words. They're well meant, actually, but it sounds a little bit bad. I say shit. And I do say fuck. I do say fuck a lot. But Montreal, I think you should fuck a lot. Yeah. Yeah. But just for the sake of decency and education, I will go a little bit more, let's just say, educational and a little bit more biological now. So it's not all, all just feet. You know, when one person meets another person. Sometimes it's just unavoidable. They just have to.
And now comes the good part. thousands of years even. And still today in in imbecile, infantile, medieval societies, the female orgasm is regarded as a craft of the devil. Was that a yes or no, or what was that? 